What's going on, guys? All right, the first item you're gonna need is down here in the city, underground roadside. Spawn in here. Uh, I have this door open already, so this is easy for me to get to. But if you go to the left and jump down, you'll you'll it all leads back and forth to each other. You just gotta jump down on these pipes. I use the cat talisman to not take damage here. I try to clip this down as best I can to make it concise, but it is what it is. So once you get down to the bottom, there's a bunch of lobsters down here. Or not a bunch, there's two. So I guess a few? No. A set? Yeah, so for time, I sped this up. Just defeat the lobsters. Or if you want, just run around them. Alright, from this room right here, you can go and pick up the Moog Shackle. That's the one item we're going to need to cheese Moog. Lord of Blood then comes spawn back to where his main area is. Oh, his battle arena, whatever you want to say. Man, I love that linger. So, you definitely know where it is. Now you're going to use the Moog Shackle in your items three times outside the fog door. And then once you use it on the third time, just enter, and he will be glitched still. This is after the latest patch, and he will not attack you. So whatever weapon you use, you just can't... I sped this up. You can't use it enough to stagger him, because once you stagger him, he'll get up, his AI will kick back in, and he will destroy you. So I sped this up, but in between each attack, I, w I literally counted to 15 seconds, and then I attacked again, because the sword I'm using has such a heavy poise and stagger that I kept on staggering him. But you'll soon defeat him and uh, yeah, and that's how you cheese Moog Lord of Blood. Be sure to like and subscribe guys, I made this all from my PlayStation 5. I will see you guys next time.